no, 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 no. You can't have your cake yet. I'm going to open a present. Oh, me. no, not yet. You've got to wait till everybody's here. Go on, sit down, <sighs> sit down. Go on. Right, I best get off. Oh, can you not stay a bit longer? No, it's not really my scene. Well, you've got murders to catch, haven't you, love? <laughs> well, thanks for the presents. The kids will love them. No problem. See you later. See ya. Flipping heck. What's up with you? Jesus, why has got here? I've lost track of time. I'm going to be late for him again. Oh, well, this is carnage, this. I'll be back as quick as I can. Oh, morning, Billy. Sorry, I'm rushing. All right. Hi, hi. Just Tim brought this round with the quads. Oh, they're being spoiled rotten today. Well, Paul bought it a few months ago. Just in case he... No, don't, 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 don't you start. Yeah, sorry. Now you're going to get me going. Mm. That's lovely, that is. Hey, kids. This present here. It's from Uncle Paul. Is Paul coming? No, love, he's not. We've been through this. Yeah, but he'll be here in spirit, I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah, I need a love today. Loved it! Where will we open the presents? Soon. Soon, Soon. we can open the presents. Yes, so should I, should I, like, uh, text her or not? No. OK, play cool. You'll see her at the party later. Can I even go to the party? I mean, she said she wanted some space. Well, you see? See, he's right, man. I mean, I don't even know if she wants me there. Well, but what does your heart tell you, Devendra? Hmm? Well, you know, to, like, uh, pick her up and squeeze her up and... No, 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 I said your heart. <laughs> I don't know. I said that I love her, yeah, I miss her. OK, but it's too soon for that. Hey, she's only just dumped you. Excuse me, I wasn't dumped. Can I say she needed space? There's a big difference. Well, then the answer is clear. You need to sweep the lady off her feet. No. I, I agree with Mary. Yeah, you would, because you've got no idea. <laughs> I've been in more relationships than you. I think I picked now, up... Now, children, there's no need to bicker. Mm. We're trying to assist your father. OK, but Mary, I think we might just have to accept that he's beyond our help. <laughs> Come on, man, one little text. It's really not gonna hurt, is it? Well, would Serrano de Bergerac send a text? Go big or go home. Mm -hmm. uh, no, don't listen to him. Dad. Yeah. Bernie is still grieving over Paul. Yeah. OK, and she's fuming about Chesney. The last thing she wants is you hassling her. But listen, it's, it's called being attentive, all right? Thought, thoughtful, you know, caring. Uh, and and there's no harm in, in, in letting her know what she's missing. <laughs> a grand romantic gesture. Exactly. No, I give up. No. Oh! Here he is, Jet Set Willie! Oh, you're back then. How was it? Great, yeah. I think I'm having a skier now. Oh, yeah, that's a good job, being a skier. Yeah, if only I had the lessons. Yeah, maybe, when we win the lottery. Right, let's get this party started. Woo! <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. What's up? I've got another shift. I know. I better go. Oh, can't you say no? Jimmy, if I don't take it, I'll get less jobs. It's the birthday party. I've only just got back. We need the money. Oh, I'm sorry. Have fun, you lot. Where? Flipping Dev Alan is this? Mm. Where's my daddy gone? He's coming to work, love, but he'll be back soon. It's getting on really well. Yeah, well, I shan't trick you out yet. Mm. I took your advice, ma'am. Extra deodorant? Mm -hmm. No, no, the other one, the other, the, 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 the romantic gesture. Oh, yeah. yeah. Good. Yeah, because yeah, you're right. You know, go big. Yeah. You just let her know just what she means to me. Please don't tell me you've gone all cliche with chocolates or flowers. Come on, man. what did you take me for? It's all like the village idiot. It's all like someone who's not okay with social norms. In a good way. Mm. Listen, I know what I'm doing, all right? And this is going to blow her away. What is it? All in good time, son. All in a good time. Look at you! Right, uh, ladies and jelly spoons, can I have your attention, please? Because I'm going to amaze you by making something fun. Simple, simple balloons into animals of your choice. Did you know I could do blue animals? No. Nope. What animal would you like me to make? Tortoise. Yeah. Lion. Yeah. Princess. Two on camel. <laughs> How about a dog? Yeah. Sure, he actually can. Mm, no. 
You like dogs? A dog game is an animal with four legs. And ta-da! Oh, is that a dog? Yeah, riff! <laughs> or how about two snakes? Oh. What are you telling me could do this? I can't afford a kid's entertainer, can I? So you've got someone who's not entertaining at all. Uh-oh. There's something wrong with this balloon, isn't it? You sure it's not just you? No. <laughs> There's something inside it, isn't it? Can I have a volunteer, please? How about Nana? I'd rather not. Nana Bunny, please. <sighs> now, there is something in there. Would you like to help me get it out? What is he doing? No idea. Oh! oh. Nothing. No, oh, the ring. Oh, no. It's a ring. Perhaps it's an engagement ring. Bernadine Winter, will you marry me? What's the quads party today? Yeah, it is. But somebody ruined it. Tantrums and tiaras. They are that age, I guess. Mm. No, it... It wasn't one of the kids. I know it was a shock, but I meant it. How dare you make the quads party all about you? Mm. That wasn't my intention. Really? Because it sure looked that way. No, I thought it would be fun and spontaneous. I thought it would make you smile. I thought it would make the kids smile. No, you didn't. You thought I'd get back in a good book, so I'll propose to her, and then she'll forgive me for everything I've done wrong. That's really cynical. As if I didn't have enough to deal with today. The first birthday without Apollo. Gemini's all over the shop and no Chesney because of you. You know, I barely slept a wink last night. And I'm trying to keep everybody's spirits up. I've still not had confirmation about the space launch. And then you fling a proposal at me, completely out of the blue. Yeah, and I'm sorry. And you're right, the timing was really bad, but that's typical, isn't it? That's, that's me. But I just wanted to show you just how much I care. You know, just how much I love you. Because I really do. I know. But I'm not in the right headspace to feel it back. I think we should call it quits. Are you breaking up with me? 